standoff between the ex-US President Donald Trump and the FBI over a search they wanted to carry out at his Florida resort for what is seen as hugely classified documents. Donald Trump has now said that he would welcome them going to court to release the reasons a warrant was actually given to the FBI. Donald Trump's run-in with the FBI just got weirder, taking his US presidency years to a new low. The big question is just what was the FBI when it raided his Florida Mar-a-Lago property? That I'm always concerned the Washington Post has reported that they were looking for documents of national security, including on nuclear weapons. While that hasn't been confirmed nor denied, the US Attorney General has unusually spoken out on this an ongoing investigation. The big question is, did Trump take secret documents when he left the White House? The department did not make any public statements on the day of the search. The former president publicly confirmed the search that evening, as is his right. The department filed the motion to make public the warrant and receipt in light of the former president's public confirmation of the search the surrounding circumstances, and the substantial public interest in this matter. Now Trump has supported the top law officer's move to make public the search warrant, as well as a list of what was seized, but for entirely different reasons. He's been claiming that the raid is politically motivated. Not only will I oppose the release of documents related to the un-American, unwarranted and unnecessary raid and break-in of my home, in Palm Beach, Florida, Mar-a-Lago, I'm going a step further by encouraging the immediate release of those documents, is what Trump said in a post. Trump supporters condemned the search. They came out on the streets with flags. Some went on to threaten the FBI on social media.